Hi guys, it's Tim from Advancing Car Technologies and today we're doing another quick how-to um, on how to use the Krista dongle and this time we are going to show you how to do the needle sweep. So uh, we're using a T5 uh, as an example but as long as you have the Highline dashboard with either the trip computer or the multifunction steering wheel buttons um, and your cluster is compatible for it then you can get the needles to sweep every time you do the ignition on. Um, so you need to make sure you've got your dongle plugged in uh, you've got your app installed for Carista either on your iPhone or an Android device. We're going to use um, an iPhone just because we've got those access to those. And uh, we'll run through the steps on how to do it and um, you can do it yourself. So get ready. Okay, so you've got your Carista dongle. Um, you just need to locate your OBD port which is in on the right hand drive vehicle. It is on the driver's side. So you make sure it's locating the right way around. Turn it in and plug it in. Obviously make sure your ignition is on so that it will activate and you could, should hopefully see that it's now gone red. So what we'll do is we will jump onto the iPhone and I'll do the screenshot. You'll sh I'll show you how to do it as a video on there and I'll overlay the audio on top so then you can see how you do it. Okay, so now you've got your Carista dongle plugged in, uh, much like the big digital speedo video that we've done. Um, all you need to do is uh, make sure you've got an active subscription running so you can go into here and restore your purchases if you haven't already. Um, uh, but you do need that either $9.99 for a week or the, the year plan or the annual plan that you get a free month and it's like £34. So um, you're going to click customise. Once it's plugged in, you don't have to do anything with your with your with your device. Um, you just go in there and uh, connect up. Click on the customize. It will pair to your Carista dongle automatically, um, and it will quickly run through the vehicle. Make sure that there's well, see if there's any faults and all this sort of stuff. So it does take a few seconds to do it. Uh, you probably heard the bong there. And uh, once it's done, it will give you a whole list of options of things that you can go into change. Um, so we'll just give it a few more seconds to, to run through things there. So we are doing this on a Transporter T5 at the moment, but like I've mentioned before, uh, and I'll show you in a second with the, uh, the camera and how it works when you do the needle sweep, is you have to have that type of dashboard. Not every dashboard will do it, uh, but it's quite likely if you've got the Highline display um, that shows you more information, gives you trip computer and all that sort of business, then it's more than likely that Carista can go in there and do what you want it to do. So nearly done few more percent and we're in okay so you've got doors windows remote you've got instruments displays dings lights and others so today we're just concentrating on instruments so we're going to click into that okay so once you're clicked into it you've got all these different settings so don't panic if you don't know what you're looking at it's very very simple so we've already done the big digital speedo which is what i've, I've mentioned previously that's why it's set to australia but we're going to be scrolling down to gauge needle sweep at startup so we're going to click onto there again you need to make sure that you've got the unlocked pad padlock symbol um, to be able to save it so you've got to get that subscription in place before you start or whilst you're working on it you click yes and then you click save it takes a couple of seconds again and once it's done it will then allow you when you every time you turn the ignition on the key um, it will do the needle sweep so what we'll do is we'll turn the camera back on we'll show you the needle sweep in action um, and then you then you know how it works and look right once you've uh, finished with your Carista and done all your coding now's the exciting part of seeing the needle sweep on your dashboard I've set the camera up so you can sort of see both of the the dials and they should spin when we get the key and we plumb it in so all you literally do every time you start up the car is you pop your ignition on your needles will sweep around like that. It doesn't really do much of a function apart from look cool when you start your vehicle up. Um, it's meant to, it goes back to the day where if you're in a race car, it used to clear the clocks and stuff like that because, but now you don't need that sort of thing. But yeah, so um, this is using the Carista dongle, um, as mentioned before. So this will allow you to save a bit of money, do it yourself, and also uh, have a little play with your car. So um, we're going to do a few more of these how-to videos with Carista, I think, because uh, we've done the big digital speedo, and now we've done the needle sweep, um, so we might do a few more. Um, so as long as you've got this type of dashboard um, with the screen that you can control either through here or on here, and you can do things like scrolling through the different uh, pages, then you can do needle sweep. Um, so if you've got any questions, uh, just pop them in the comment box below and uh, we'll help out as much as we can. And thanks for watching.